is the on-ground situation right now? How many people have been evacuated? And just give us a better sense of the picture. See, the thing is that um, it's not been the first time India is facing such disaster. You know, uh, for last uh, last one decade, we have we have seen a lot of uh, a lot of. Uh, uh, "Quote unquote," these uh, natural calamities. So this time, uh, and uh, before, uh, in last three four years, the uh, preparedness has increased, and now uh, you know the better disaster, disaster management mechanism is at play uh, in place. So uh, in Odisha, everybody knows that more than a million uh, people were uh, evacuated uh, in uh, within 24 hours. For that, uh, we will have to thank the uh, um, better uh, early warning mechanism in place, and, uh, and that is because. You know, all the shelter homes were uh, in place. Uh, the, the, the administration uh, was ready to ev evacuate. A, a rapid transit from the endangered shoreline to the safe shelter houses was in place. And uh, and uh, despite that, you know, there was a lot of damage in the temple city of Puri uh, along the coast and also uh, in the, the capital uh, city of uh, Bhuvaneshwar of uh, Odisha. So yeah. um, uh, the, the th things have not uh, completely uh, back in uh, on track. Still, I was speaking to some of the people. Omar will tell you more because he was uh, he. Uh, I believe he visited uh, to the ground. Uh, but electricity and telephone um, lines were still not working till last evening in the major parts of the uh, of the city. Yeah, uh, uh, Mr. Joshi, you mentioned here that within 24 hours, so many people were evacuated. How many people, how many teams, which governmental uh, bodies, uh, were there NGOs around that were helping people evacuate the scene? What can you tell us about that? See, uh, a, a lot of government bodies, NGOs, and also volunteers. I was uh, being uh, told that more than uh, around 50,000 uh, volunteers was also working. Working, uh, but the chief minister himself took uh, uh, to, uh, took a meeting with the officers uh, um, uh, just before the cyclone uh, uh, had to land. And uh, you know, uh, we are being told that weeks ago, uh, even a, uh, even a month months before. They knew that uh, cyclones, or a cyclone of this intensity and uh, th this, uh, you know, severity is landing. So uh, uh, you, uh, I would like to tell you that in 2013 also, uh, to a file landed in uh, in uh, Odisha. Uh, besides the much talked cyclone in 1999, which killed more than 10,000 people, and also Hodhud arrived at uh, a neighboring uh, state of uh, Vishakhapatnam, uh, which I covered uh, in uh, 2014. Uh, which devastated Vishakhapatnam. Uh, also, it, uh, it had its own effect on uh, on Odisha and other parts of uh, our shoreline, east coast of India. So uh, they have been, you know, now they are becoming quite uh, habitual of, you know, uh, uh, attending and uh, dealing with these kind of disasters. Yeah. But there is a uh, other side of this we, we, we will discuss uh, uh, ahead in the program. Yeah.